trying to see, it looks like there is possibly a school of fish or maybe a shark. try saying that like three times fast the seashell shop but seashell shop seashell shop, shop, seashell shop. shop. <laughs> they have um it's like a really just cute beach gift shop but then they also have one of my favorite things they have mini golf right over there which that was in that video that i had when we came here for the couple days and we were staying up in rehoboth we had gone here and played some mini golf and yeah that was a fun time So we just brought all of our stuff down. We have our little setup here. Yay! Okay, so we're set up on the beach. This is what I've been waiting for all summer. It's just like relaxing on the beach with this view in front of us. We got a pretty good spot. Like we're pretty close right down to the water. We're looking at the boardwalk. Like the main part of the boardwalk is like a little bit down that way. So we're already thinking like, where do we want to go for food and everything? But yeah, this is just so nice right now. So, so nice. Seven, three, seven, three. Here's the current view right here. currently have like a whole operation over here we're trying to see so my dad actually has he brought his binoculars with him and we're trying to see it looks like there is possibly a school of fish or maybe a shark like out in the water and there's a fishing boat out there and they're like anchoring right around the area where we were looking so I feel like there's something out there <laughs> mom what did you just say <laughs> it's the ocean there's something there's out there. something out there well yeah there's lots out there <laughs> 
It's just a matter of is it right here? I have a feeling it is. Wait, where'd the boat go? Oh, it's over there. I see it. Okay, we spotted something again. Is that a bird? No, there's something in there though. So I just took the binoculars and we confirmed it is, it looks like a dolphin, but I believe around here they're porpoises, but like equally exciting. Like how cool is that? It's like so close. Yeah, let's see, maybe I'm gonna move up there and see if we can get a better view. You lost it, oh no. And out further. Right there. Right there. Right there. The water, as hot as it is out here, it's like close to 100 degrees, temp, like real feel wise. It's been like, like oh, it's icy. Yeah, no, I don't like it. I will not be getting in there. I need my water like warm. I need Florida beach water. <laughs> yeah, it's chilly. It's like I'd, I'd be fine like walking along and feeling it on my feet, but actually getting in, no. And we clearly know there's stuff in there as well. to the boardwalk and see maybe we can get like a little snack or something. It's a crowded day going into a weekend. It's a Friday when we're here. Friday, August 13th. And tomorrow's an exciting day because August 14th, that's my birthday. Yay! Yeah, <laughs> so it's a kick off to kick off to birthday weekend right now. <laughs> yeah, couldn't think of a better way to spend it. I'm definitely a beach girl. You know, you got the people are mountain people, beach people. I'm a beach person all the way. I like the, because <laughs> here we are, as we're like, oh my gosh, it's cold. We're Florida beach people. And until we can go to a Florida beach as our local beach, we'll come here and we're happy with it. <laughs> but we just won't be in the water. <laughs> we're cracking up off, like literally. And we're like, we're beach people. As we're like, oh, it's cold. We're running, running out of the water. Yeah. Oh my goodness. You people know what I'm talking about. In the sand art of an octopus. That's incredible. Oh my gosh, I would like love to try that sometime. That is so cool. That's such a craft to be able to do that and like get the sand to stick and stay. I that's amazing. Alright, so we actually just passed the like boardwalk entrance back that way. It's not a very long boardwalk here at Bethany, but it's so cute. And they have some little side streets and stuff off of the boardwalk as well, like in the main area. So we'll go up there in a bit, but we're actually gonna keep on walking. Head down this way, just because it's so relaxing. Like this is just, I love walks on the beach. This is something that I love so much. So yeah, I'm in my glory right now. This my toes in the water, walking on the beach. Okay, so we just turned around. We're heading back kind of towards the main part of Bethany Beach where the boardwalk is and everything and we're gonna go up there but we walked a pretty far distance. What was this mom? Almost a mile? That way. So that's probably about another mile back and then we're gonna take a break, have yeah. some lunch and then another walk in the other direction. Yes, then we'll go the other way. But yeah, going this way, the way that we just went, we almost were to Maryland. Like you, the next thing would be you cross over to Fenwick Island. It was, a while, so it was yeah. all a while, but we were. I was like, that'd be fun sometimes, just to, like to walk all the way down to like Ocean City, Maryland, like probably on like a less hot day. Like when you could do that. Yes, yeah, so we're heading back now this direction. Up 
onto the boardwalk and look, this is the very end of the Bethany Beach boardwalk right here. So we're gonna head down this direction to where everything is. Oh my gosh, she flew away. But I was just saying, I love how every single one of these pillars, it seems like has a bird. A seagull is like standing there. I'm like, you're just making this like a perfect picture opportunity right now. Like I'm able to get all the photographs. Thank you guys. <laughs> so cute little boardwalk gift shop. All right, so we just came off of the boardwalk. This is what I was kind of talking about. They have this whole center section that it kind of extends down with more shops and little dining spots. So we are heading, that's a cool place, the Bethany Surf Shop. That's very iconic right there. But yeah, our favorite spot to get fries is right down here. And you gotta get boardwalk fries when you're at the beach. So these fries here, this is the place that I was telling you guys is our favorite. I just saw on the thing, it says they're cooked in peanut oil. And I believe that that's how the Casey's Corner fries are cooked as well. And that explains why we like them so much. <laughs> that looks good. Yeah. And the only way to enjoy boardwalk fries like this, you gotta douse it in vinegar. Oh gosh, they're real hot. You have to douse it in vinegar. I love, love vinegar. <laughs> Yeah, I think the plan is later tonight we might come and explore some of these shops. Come and explore some of these shops that are around here. Oh my goodness, look at the hermit crabs, you guys. I used to have hermit crabs. I love them. Okay, so now we made it down to the other end of the boardwalk in this direction. And we're gonna head back onto the beach. Oh, wait, here's the thing about dolphins. So wait, it is dolphins then, I guess that we can see here, right? Yeah. Earlier I said it was porpoises, but dolphins I guess are here. <laughs> To our spot we go. Oh, I love it here. So pretty. The beach is so relaxing. So we just enjoyed a nice little like relax on the beach. We were just laying there. Oh gosh, that is chilly now. <laughs> we came back down to the water here and we're gonna walk around. It is now um, we're gonna walk this direction now and go down this way and it is now low tide So we're saying this would be like the prime time to see if we could find some shells You guys know I love shelling whenever I'm at the beach. I love to collect shells So it seems like so far these are all like kind of pieces parts of shells. There's no like intact ones. So We'll keep looking Watch how fast he can hide now.
have a rare sight. They pretty much have the ocean cleared out here. All the lifeguards were calling people in um, because I think they were, we overheard there's um, riptides in the area. So we have everybody up out of the water right now, but you get really good shots like this. <laughs> Nobody in the water. This also could be the reason they're actually calling people in. There's a storm in the area. A storm is coming. <laughs> the app did not say today that there was going to be storms, but you never know. Summer pop-up storms. Over this way, it's beautiful though. I've never experienced anything like this. They just made the announcement that we have to evacuate the beach because the storm is coming in. And my dad just went to put meter, money in the meter. And we have to try to get all this up there. <laughs> I did not have a spare hand, but that was the moment that should have been vlogged. So we were like watching that storm and it looked like it was gonna pass over us. And then all of a sudden, like the one girl who worked for the umbrella rental, she was like coming around and shutting all the rental umbrellas and saying like, oh, we just have to wait till the storm passes. And I'm like, oh, maybe this is just like, uh, you know, formality. Like they're making sure like just in case it comes because everyone was just like hanging out on the beach. Like no one seemed concerned. And like I said, my dad was putting more money in the meter, like to give us another hour. We wanted to sit on the beach a little bit longer and out of nowhere, like the skies like open up like it was raining well before that they actually made the call everyone had to um get off the beach and me and mom without dad we were trying to pack up everything and we knew there was no way with like the cooler and everything we wouldn't make it but he showed up right like in the nick of time but we did a pretty good job we were like we were hustling to get off the beach we were on it yeah we were hauling all this stuff but yeah now i'm just like all standing and sitting in the car we didn't have time to like shower off or change or anything this is an event i don't think i've ever been on the beach when it's rained before so this was like a first but it's pretty memorable now yes, the storm is now coming So currently our game plan, we are going to just drive around the town here and wait for this to pass because we can tell it's gonna pass over. Like it's not like one of those storms that hopefully it's not gonna be here all night. Like it seems like they were all saying that on the beach too, like it will pass over. So we're gonna ride it out. And then our game plan, we're gonna go back, find a parking spot, go up on the boardwalk, go see the shops we wanted to see, figure out what we're gonna do for dinner. So there we go, that's our game plan, updated game plan. I'm wondering, maybe actually the storm right now will kind of like clear out some of the crowds. Cause I have a feeling a lot of people will like just call it a night, like go back to their house or, you know, rental or whatever. So I don't know, I'm thinking maybe we might have like a relaxing night on the boardwalk. Okay, it's pretty much slowed up now. So we're parked our car here. We're now on the main strip here in Bethany Beach where I was showing you earlier, we got our fries literally like right over there. And this is where, or actually right down there. But yeah, so this is where um, they have all like the shops and everything. So this is what we're gonna do now. We're gonna walk around and get to take everything in, see what we can, see what we can find, see what we're gonna do for dinner. It's gonna be very fun. Either direction, probably. This place right here is Sandy Pony Donuts. Look at their menu. And they have edible cookie dough. Oh my gosh. All right, time to start doing some shopping and enjoy our evening here. <laughs> this rope walk, they actually have a like sand bar that they made. That is so cool. Also back there, my dad just bought a design that said Crush Bar. You guys know I love the traditional Maryland um orange crush so they have them here too which has me very very excited it's my favorite beverage whenever i want to treat myself to a beverage that is like my beverage of choice at the beach <laughs> our first stop we're actually going to go up to the boardwalk here to the little like feet showers that they have because we are still <laughs> i threw this sundress on just in the car but like we are still covered 
in sand because we really like we had to run off the beach we didn't get to like do the typical like shake everything out everything like the car is gonna have to be vacuumed out it's like everything is covered in sand right now <laughs> including us we're covered in sand we're looking around in these little boardwalk gift shops and look here's these hermit crabs look at them i said earlier in the video how i had hermit crabs growing up they're so cute they're so fun oh look at this guy We're now heading inside of this is Bethany's big surf shop here, the Bethany Surf Shop. It's located upstairs here. So of course I found my way back to the walk-up crush bar. These are the different flavors. Orange, of course, is the classic, but blueberry lemon sounds very, very interesting. Yeah, the dude was like a I know blueberries. There's the lemon on into the crust. All right, four o'clock crew. You guys back on the patio. The world is out there. So get Okay, my crush is acquired. So they convinced me inside to go with the blueberry lemon because they said that is their house specialty. So like, I have to go with the house specialty. That. That's awesome. <laughs> Look how cute it is. It's like, so it's almost pink. It's so pretty. And you're not even really much of a crush person, but you said you like this better I don't than like orange. a lot of mixed drinks, with Ooh, yeah, try but it. I do love blueberry. It's so. amazing. It's like, so just like, like this a than pop orange in your mouth. <laughs> they had me try down in St. Michael's, I yes. think. This, yeah. This is very light. He said very light. Very light, yeah. And that's probably what I like. You can't taste the alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. It is delicious. I will get this again. Like, if you're coming here, get this. Get this. Yeah, that's yeah. good. <laughs> this is, oh my gosh. Cheers! <laughs> okay, this is where you find the Woke Up Crush Bar. It's this, um, how do you say that? Baja? Baja? Baja. 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 I always get that wrong. Baja. Fresh Mex. I would love to try it. looks like they serve like a Mexican cuisine. That would be good. Yeah, look, there's their menu. I'll have to try that sometime here. Oh, so it's kind of like Tex-Mex. Yeah. Oh, Life's better with a Maine Coon. Oh, with a Maine Coon. There's a schnitz. I literally I can't get over this and like you said it's such a good price it was six dollars for the um, 16 ounce here like that's really a good price for a crush oh my gosh I, I'm so happy with this this get this one too the blueberry lemon <laughs> this is so good they have to <laughs> tell people do not sit <laughs> that means someone has tried it like seriously it's suspended off the ground but they have to have a do not sit sign oh my gosh oh. this always makes me happy when you have dogs welcome oh and we have treats that i want to like support businesses like that that's wonderful i just got a picture by this little instagram spot that they have here but how perfect is it they have the angel wings but then they also have angel wings for your dog so you could have like a photo together i love that oh it's a bug that's cute oh. Look at all the Old Bay they got here. Hers, Old Bay. Oh, hers does Old Bay. Oh, that's interesting. Oh my gosh, Dog Days Splash Zone. There's a little pool for your dog. Okay, that is amazing. Look at that, it's right outside of this gift shop we just came out of. All right, now we're gonna check out the shops over here on this side of the street before we head out to our dinner location. Oh my that was so cute. <laughs> this is so funny. I can remember this as a kid coming here when Crocs were like the in thing and you had to be cool, you know, to have Crocs. Like it was 
they had this was like the whole wall the whole wall was nothing but gibbets for your crocs now they have like more of a small section of it but crocs are coming back in so you can get all your gibbets here oh christmas ornaments i know i was saying for my travel tree i do not have anything that says bethany beach that's just like kind of written on there gotta keep looking this is so fun this one whole back room is nothing but mermaid oh my gosh look at this this store is so cool i'm so excited i found my christmas ornament look it has my name on the front but i'll probably display this side which has from the shores of Bethany Beach. How cute is that? I, I love like that. Blue, uh, yes, I know. Cause look, these. I feel like this is like such a nice, you know, placement of all the gels and everything. Only seven ninety nine. So there we go. That will be for my travel tree. I said I feel like, I feel like Pam from the office. It's like I'm letting the ice melt to get second drink. <laughs> this is so good. Scoop the blueberries. Scoop out, the blueberries out. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, on this side of the street this is what i was kind of showing earlier we got our fries right down there this is the bethany town center and they have more shops down this way how cute is this oh they have a doggy ice cream place <laughs> so cute look at this so we came inside they have this arcade here just like we did in williamsburg we have a duck catcher and i did promise mickey before we left the house we would win him something so we're gonna win him a duck. <laughs> okay, let's play. Putting the dollar in. We're gonna win Mickey a little prize. Okay, I just tried, but no luck. But this is one of those games you get to play till you win. So, most the of them have, the yes, most of them all have the basketball. There's a few different things, but not many. Oh, I think I got him. You got him. Oh, it's a purple one. How cute. <laughs> There's our duck. Oh my gosh, Mickey will love it. Quack, quack. I will insert the footage right now of us giving it to Mickey. <laughs> Mickey, look what we have. It's a new duck front. Oh, he loves it. Look, what's that? You gonna bat him? You excited? Mickey, what's that? Oh, he's gonna get you. There we go. <laughs> One little whack. So we also got some Fisher's popcorn, which, oh, I didn't realize it's gluten-free. This is like iconic of the beach here. It is so, so good. And we're heading to dinner right now, but we have to have, it's warm right now, so we have to have a couple bites of this. Okay, so we are heading to our dinner location. We are heading to the Indian River Marina. They have an incredible restaurant here called Hammerheads that we discovered a couple years ago. And oh my gosh, it is incredible. Okay, so this is actually the state park that we're going to, um, to have dinner is on the bay side. And then literally though, right over there, like that is right past those dunes that is the beach side that's the ocean and then it's so cool like right over here is the inlet the bay so really like when you're on this stretch you have like the ocean the bay it's very nice we always like walking around up here because they have in the marina here on the bay that you can see all the boats and everything Okay, we just arrived so you can see over that way there is the marina and this up here is where we're gonna head this is home to hammerheads this is so fun they're taking us over right on the water look at that Dogs on boats. Love dogs on boats. <laughs> Aww. Is it the 
another one in there too. There's two big doggies. Oh my gosh, he's getting up one. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How cute is this? Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh my gosh, that was fast that our food arrived. So let me show you what we got here. So they have like, you can pay per taco type situation so you can get as many as you want. So me and mom, we both got two. You got both of the mahi-mahi. Mahi, mahi. And then I got a mahi-mahi and a lobster. So I'm excited to try that. And then dad, you got a salad. Uh -huh. And what type of soup did you get? Cream of crab. Cream of crab soup, gotta do it when you're, when you're down by the shore. Because it's my birthday weekend, I had to, of course, have dessert. So, here's my key lime pie. This is my favorite, favorite type of pie. Oh, I'm excited. Look at it. It looks so good. Look at the presentation with like the little key lime zest. Okay, dinner was excellent. We love it here so much. Those tacos, gosh, they were so delicious. Some of the best fish tacos, seriously. And the key lime pie, you just, you can't go wrong with key lime pie. It was amazing. So now, to cap off our night before we head home, we are going to walk on the docks here and look at the beautiful boats that are in. See, right back there, that's where we sat. That's the Hammerhead's dock side. I mean, look at this. What a perfect beach day. It's amazing. Here's another part of the restaurant here. You can actually have your feet in the sand as you're dining. Guys, so I just realized that I never filmed an outro to this video, so I wanted to go ahead and do that right now and say thank you so much for watching. This was such a fun day. I love getting to document our family vacation, our little family day trip down to Delaware to celebrate my birthday weekend. We had the best time. It was just such an amazing day. And then I also am gonna have some footage coming up here from my birthday weekend and the festivities that I got up to. I went up to Hershey with some friends. We had a little family party. So I will be sharing all of that as well. And then of course, I have my Disney vlogs coming in sporadically as well, all of my Disney content. So thank you guys for watching this video. Please go ahead, give this video a thumbs up, leave me some comments down below, all those things, your likes, your comments, your subscriptions, it goes so far in helping to support me and support the channel. So thank you for taking the time to do that. And with that, make today magical, and I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye guys.